Well, you guys got another video on how to install and configure and set up OpenVPN on Windows 10 and Windows 11. We're on Windows 11 here, but you can use the same method on Windows 10. So first off, what you're going to need to do is head over to your browser and type in OpenVPN. From here, you can download OpenVPN. So we're going to go to here. And from here, we're going to go to the Community tab. Go to Community and go to Downloads. So here we have our download section. Let me just get rid of those. There we go. And you can see here we have a bunch of installs that we can do here for 32 bit Windows and 64 bit here. So whatever you're looking for here will be listed here. So we're going to go for the Windows 64 bit installer. And uh, what we're going to do here is download it. We're going to concentrate on this one here. So let's go ahead and download this. And we're going to click on an MSI file. So what we're going to do here is we're going to click on install. And this will install OpenVPN onto this PC. Say yes to the user account control. And we're going to let this install. It takes a bit of time, so be patient. And it's installing all of the necessary files that we're going to need to set up this VPN on here. And once this is done, we'll be able to configure it and get it ready. So you can see here, OpenVPN installing complete. So we're going to click close here. And you may get this error code coming up here. Don't worry about it. It's because we haven't got the config file installed on here. And you can see here, it's asking us to put in the config file into this location here. Users and your username open and it says VPN and config or program files open VPN config. And it's not readable. So that's okay. We're going to close that off. But you can see your VPN. VPN uh, GUI here. You can't uh, click on this as of yet, but if we look down here, you should now see open VPN GUI here. And we can right click on this and we can import our files that we need here, uh, import URL and so on. And there's some settings here. So let's go ahead and get the files that we're going to need. So we'll open our browser up and we're going to go to free VPN, which is a VPN book. I'm going to come down here. And what we're going to do is look for OpenVPN here on the tabs. And from here, you can see there's a bunch of different areas here. So we've got France, which is FR1 and FR8. And you've also got, I think that's California. And we've got US, DE and PL. And that's probably Poland. And that's probably, uh, probably Germany or Denmark or something like that. So what we're going to do here is see the, the actual information here for the username and also the password. So let's go ahead and download one that's closest to us, which is France. I'm going to download this uh, certificate bundle. There we go. And uh, we're going to just drag that onto the desktop here. There we are. So here we have the files here. So we need to extract these and put them into that location. So what we're going to do here is we're going to extract these. So we're going to right click here and we're going to extract all. And we're going to extract them to our desktop. So let's extract them. And there we have our files. So we've got three files inside here. And now we can import these into our OpenVPN. So let's go ahead and do that. So what I'm going to do is I'm going to go down to the bottom right hand side. And you can see the OpenVPN uh, GUI here. It's going to right click, import, file. And this will open up this window here. We need to navigate to that folder. So I'm going to go here into this folder and we're going to choose the first one here. Click open. And now you can see OpenVPN GUI for Windows imported files successfully down on the bottom right hand side. You can import the other ones, but we'll just do one for now for this video. Once that's done, and now you can see it's already running. Right click on the tray and start the icon. So we can right click now and you can now see that we've got some settings here. We've got connect, view log, edit config, import and settings. So let's go ahead and connect. And you will get 
this box popping up because it wants us to put in our username and password. So remember there was a username and password on that website. So let's go ahead and get that username and password. And you can see it right here. All you need to do is paste in these details. And it's not letting you uh, copy this in like that. So you're going to have to do this manually. So let's go ahead and do that. You can save the password. It is now connected. There we go. And there we have, we've got an IP assigned and we've now got our VPN working. So if we look down on the bottom right here, you can now see that we got uh, showing up as blue and if you do uh, what's my IP you will see there'll be a different IP address and you won't be able to see it there but the IP address has been changed and that means we are in another country showing up here anyway that's going to be about it that's how you can install set up and configure OpenVPN on Windows 11 and Windows 10 Hope this one's been some use to you. My name has been Brian from brightechcomputers.co.uk. Just want to say a quick shout out to all my YouTube members who join my YouTube members group. I really do appreciate the support and I shall catch you in the next video. Bye for now.